in 1988. Please direct your attention to the video wall. Let's relive that run 40 years ago when the nation saw your University of Louisville Cardinals win their first NCAA title. This is it. What people don't realize is how we changed the game of college basketball. We were the first team to bring. Before five slap pajamas, before five five, it was down to the dunk. Making a run like that, how, how lucky we were in the sense that, you know, we had two overtime games. First two, take the game. But you know, the only one I was worried about. The first one, Kansas State. Yeah. Carol and his talented teammates almost had their streak ended early in the Midwest Regional, surviving a 71 69 overtime thriller against Kansas State. If I went to the base mat, looked at my shirt, and I said, Dillard, oh, please don't let this be the last time I wore a series of Houston was next. And went to Houston. Hey, LSU. He said, LSU. He told this story. I, I know. He said that Mr. Shaw came up to him and said, Danny, he said, y'all had a hell of a year. He said, you did a great job, and, 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 and he said, y'all gonna have a problem with LSU, and then he told me, he said, are you kidding me, we'll beat this team by 20. <laughs> <laughs> and exactly what happened, then we went to the final four. That was, that was fun. This was a scoring duel that you will never forget. First it was Lester, Iowa's all-time leading scorer, and then Griffin, Louisville's all-time scorer. Well, what did you end up with that guy? Uh, okay, 34, 34, 34, yeah, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, 34, the 1980 NCAA champion University of Louisville Cardinals. We first acknowledge Steve Clark, Jerry Eames, and Wiley Brown are unable to join us, and we know that Derek Smith is here in our hearts. Our support staff, we begin with Dr. Tom Ellis, Sherry Effinger Brown, Jerry May, Steve Donahue, and Randy Buffer. From our coaching staff, Wade Houston. And the Hall of Famer, Jimmy Cron. <laughs> now, ladies and gentlemen, the doctors have done. We begin with Greg Houston. The snowman, Marty Pulliam. Daryl Cleveland. Wish a happy birthday to Scooter McRae. Tony Brand. Instant defense, Roger Berkman. Rodney McRae. And the man himself, Dr. Duncan Stein, Darrell Griffin. On behalf of the team, I know they, they recognize the people that are not with us. Of course, Derek Smith. And we don't want to forget uh, Dr. Rudy Ellis, who was very instrumental in keeping us healthy. Uh, in uh, 1980, we were your first national championship team. It was, it was almost like the city and the university's firstborn child. Today, your firstborn is 40. And we're, we're blessed to be here. Uh, when asked uh, what this day meant to us, and, and I know I can speak for my teammates, this is all about you as a fan, how we appreciate your support over the years and the support that you've given the program to enable us to come from Crawford Gym to Freedom Hall to one of the top arenas in the, in the country. Uh, not, None of, this, none of this could have happened without the fans' support. You guys must understand that when other teams come in here and look at our facilities, it's one thing. But then when they look in the stands, 
to see that we're 20,000 strong every night. That says a lot. And, and, and it means a lot to us as players. Uh, and I speak on behalf of all the players, the players before us, for the 80 National Championship team, for the uh, 1986 National Championship team, and for the 2013. <laughs> We don't need the letters in CAA to recognize our national championship team. So well, thank you very much on behalf of the 80 national championship team. With all our hope, thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, the national champion, 1980 Rural Park.